Well, Vidalia onion season started today, and they're already on, a way to, on the way to a supermarket near you. Chip Carter checks in from a Vidalia packing house. There are some annual rites of spring we look forward to each year, like the opening of swimming pools and the beginning of baseball season. We're not going to get some of those things this year, but one rite of spring we're definitely going to have is Vidalia onion season, which starts today. Due mainly to weather, including a very wet winter and a recent hailstorm that took out 500 to 700 acres of the crop, it won't be a bumper year for Vidalia, but there will still be plenty of onions to go around. We got some challenges in this crop. Um, you know, the industry planted just over 9,300 acres. We're not gonna harvest that many acres, but uh, we do have a promotable crop. We are gonna have uh, enough volume to service the industry and the retail community, so we look forward to getting these out on the shelves and uh, bringing them to the consumer's home. You know, we're, we're going to take it one day at a time and do the best we can. We've got some unusual circumstances. As you know, uh, we're considered an essential business, uh, servicing the grocery retail industry for the produce department. So, you know, for us, we got to press on and press through, and that's what we're doing. We're taking extra precautions. We're, we're, we're going to be optimistic, and um, we're going to continue to work with what we've got. We're going to manage what we've been given. Research has shown that one of the best defenses against COVID-19 is a nutritious diet that's high in anti-inflammatory foods. Few do a better job of that than onions. Onions have been around a long, long time, and they're shelf-stable, and they go in a number of different recipes. So they're a great item to buy, uh, particularly at a time like this when people are cooking at home and looking for innovative ways uh, and new recipes. We're going to be rolling these bags out today uh, all over the country. We've got uh, not only the health benefits, but the nutritional panel. We've got recipe ideas and, of course, our Schumann Farms uh, story here on the back. So just a, uh, a great a great way to, to carry these bags to market. And those are going to be available beginning uh, in retail stores tomorrow. It's not business as usual in Vidalia, Georgia this year, but there is business going on, and those onions are on the way to you. Reporting from home in Tampa, Florida, I'm Chip Carter from SoutheastProduceWeekly.com, reporting for RFD-TV. As always, thank you very much, Chip. And, of course, stay tuned. He'll have another update for us tonight. That, of course, is during the Royal Evening News. We'll get started with that about 730 Eastern.